Sasuke! God bless YouTube, <laughs> but also fuck YouTube. We just caught up a little bit. Uh, what's up, y'all? In the downtime, um, I watched the Hidan versus Shikamaru fight, as you guys recommended. How did you like that? That was that was cool. Um, the the ed, like uh, it's more so funny to watch the editing of these channels. <laughs> Try to summarize this shit in like seven it made, to twelve minutes. It made minutes. even less sense. <laughs> but you feel how many episodes you're skipping, and that feels good. No, Every time there's one of those awkward cuts, you can tell that you just you just saved like three days of content, and you're like, yeah, fine. But no, no, the ultimate thing with that though is like to see um, the advanced ways in which Shikamaru's shadow technique is usable, and. Uh, yeah, okay, so the cool, th I, I like the idea of like, okay, what's the next level of his shadow copy, uh, not shadow copy, um... Shadow possession. Sh possession stuff is yeah. one, the shadows become 3D, two, they can grab shit and throw it at you, and three, the most important one, I'd say, it says, he can throw out kunai that can stab your shadow and freeze you. Yeah. And all of that leads to uh, Hidan effectively getting ninja scrolled, because yeah, the game didn't really impl like emphasize as hard. Like, no, he blew him to fucking bits and then dropped like in the hole. Dropped him in the in hole the and hole. then <laughs> filled in the hole so that he could never like come back together. So he'll forever be yeah. And that's he he he, he did him in he did him in like like Ninja Scroll. Well, yeah, he did him in like cars. Wor worse fate than uh, than death, yeah. basically. Yeah, Which, you, I don't want that. Immortality yeah. is a curse to me. Yeah. Even if you're enjoying it. Yeah. I don't want that. <laughs> it's honestly like, uh, it, it, you, like you'd want immortality from like being killed from anything besides old age. You know what I mean? Like you'd want like I let my organs last as long as they can, but until until they give out. Yeah. But not like. Or, or the other way around. Well, that right? depends. Depends too. If immortality also means being young, then yeah. I, I well, don't that's, really like... you want one or the other. Mm -hmm. You'd want it to be like, or my my organs never fail. I stay healthy and whatnot until I'm ready to kill myself. <laughs> then I can just actually do it, one or the other. Um, so we did that, and then the other thing we did, Mount Miyamoku, let's do it. And the other thing we did was uh, the uh, Jiraiya versus Pain. Lots of important ass context in that actual anime fight that was the game ignored, including the fact that each of those faces of Pain was someone that Jiraiya recognized, and that the grandma got away with one of the bodies yeah. that he thought was Nagato, and took that back to Konoha for an autopsy. So we'll figure out what the fuck's going on there. But already it's got my brain, the gears turning in terms of like, okay, what his ability is slash what's going on. Because it's like, Jiraiya saw people specifically that he was related to. And uh, him seeing um, uh, Yahiko. Yahiko. Like, was a, something that surprised Pain to some degree. Or he reacted like, oh, you see him, huh? So that already kind of gives me an idea of what, what that... Uh, fucking Rinnegan is, is supposed to do or, or what the deal give you is. an idea of what it could what it potential. could be what it could be yes yeah. it could be something that is like context sensitive yeah. to whoever is looking at it so we'll see where that goes in the meantime we've also been alerted to the fact that this whole fucking giant animal country is exactly that it's not another dimension no. it's not another planet it's just a place really, really far away. It's, it's a place where it takes some months to get there. It's and Australia. It's just, and and, it's, <laughs> and, and you, it's like a, a maze. You, it's a, you gotta take a secret route to get to get there. Mm. But this particular place is the land of toad. That's why there's a lot of toads here. <laughs> but like the, all the animal, all the giant animals live together in this country or land that we don't name. But Mount Miyoboku is specific to the, the toad side yeah. of things. But there's a bunch of other giant animals living in this world of 
hidden summon animals. Um, it's weird that they never named that. I'll just call it Animal Country. Animal Country. <laughs> yeah. I I, sh I would like to call it uh, the Summon Monster. Uh, sure. Yeah. Because... Kaiju Kaiju Town. Yeah, we could do that. Um, but either way, it was implied that you could just, yeah, you could just hike it. It would take a long time, but you could walk there, so it's on the planet. Which, if anything, really means that summoning jutsu are just transportation. Yeah. Well, yeah, because, like, for example, Ten Ten, she used like summoning jutsu to, to get a uh, weapon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're just displacing it. So mm -hmm. the feeling that you're going through another dimension is like, because that's what you think those animals are. It really feels like they're coming from another world, right? Yeah, like, it's because I, I mistook that with um, uh, some other games like Final Fantasy, where where it's um, uh, sometimes not all Final Fantasy, but sometimes when you summon the monster, it's because they come from another yeah, dimension. Yeah, like GFs and stuff like that, mm -hmm. right? All right, so he gets a training, but his, his training is fighting. Yeah. So, we're gonna learn about Sage Mode, I hope, with, with not... Also, it was weird to, to see in that same that same fight um, with uh, while Hidan and Saishikamaru were fighting, Kakashi, Ino, and Sho Choji were fighting uh, Kakuzu, mm -hmm. right? And, uh, yeah, I guess I, 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 I thought, um, he, uh, I thought, I always thought, yeah, uh, like, my, my idea of, like, Kakashi was that, like, he's unbeatable because I'd never seen him lose a fight that I could recall, right? I think, I feel like every time I saw Kakashi fighting, like, he, he beat Zabuza, and then, like, he had a close call with, um, with I Itachi, but ultimately, like, he was able to win. Uh, or rather, like, they stalemated, They stalemated, yeah. They stalemated, yeah. yeah. But I'd never seen him lose, so the idea that this this guy that Naruto was able to beat lost... So in your mind, Kakashi is really that strong, He's huh? the strongest! In my head, Kakashi's unbeatable because I never saw a, a chapter where he lost, you know? So, yeah, that, that's kind of where my brain is at, so I guess I'm curious about what I missed in that regard. Unless there's a fight you can think of that uh, slips my mind. Yeah, I think Kakashi has a good record. Right? He's untouched. Do you have an other move, like Resin Gun or... Oh, there you go. There. Oh, the um, Resin Chicken. Yeah. Which is, he's not supposed to use. <laughs> Which you're just throwing out casually, yeah. <laughs> but you know what, like... In the context of the game, you, you can, because... They didn't, they didn't tell you that you can, that, <laughs> that is dangerous right. for his body, so... Okay, let's spam that shit. Again, all, all, they're, all they're doing is keeping Awakening Mode out, so... It looks so dumb when you're standing face to face and just charging like... This ain't Dragon Ball. Whoa. Wow. There we go. Nice job, Naruto. Um... Yeah... So he's going undertaking the same training that Jiraiya did, although he Jiraiya was way younger when he did, right? Like that Jiraiya was like like Jiraiya, Jiraiya started younger. Get Genin age? Yeah. Yeah. He like, started younger. But um he um but he, Jiraiya was not just training nonstop, he was just doing in between his mission. Mm -hmm. So if sometimes he comes back and continues training and then go, go do a, does mission, so it's not, uh, it's, a, it's a long, go, longer span of uh, time. But I assume he was further ahead than like these kids were at that age. Yeah. 
Oh, it's a hyperbolic time chamber. Well, or like, or like multiple. Uh, okay, I would, I, I would have to say that the game explains it too simply. It's, in fact, it's wrong. It's explaining it wrong. Okay, go ahead. So, no, I, I'm, I'm not gonna explain it. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna tell you that, tell you that it's wrong. Okay. And the reason why I'm not to explain it is because we're gonna watch it. Okay. <laughs> oh, he's beat. Oh my God. I it's. Yeah, I think I th people are starting. Like, I think through this, a lot of people went into to this game particularly not knowing or not remembering the d the difference between this and three and four. And a lot of uh, I'm seeing a lot of comments that say three and four are actually good solid substitutes in this way. But a lot of people just chalk two up as well and kind of forget how much it glosses over and changes versus. But there is the an overwhelming. Um, uh, people com commenting that 3 and 4 is really more accurate. Yeah, that's, that's, that's yeah. what I'm getting at. But yeah. like, early on, before starting this, people included 2 as well. Oh, yeah? Okay. But now that we're getting, now that we're here, what a trap. <laughs> it turns out memory no, isn't man. that reliable, no. <laughs> Turns out, the statistic... I, I was watching your LP and I got pissed. I was like, why did they cut that <laughs> part? <laughs> statistically, Human memory is one of the least reliable uh, forms of evidence. Yes. So as you were watching earlier, the um, the YouTube clip that's the uh, the corpse that he took. Mm -hmm. The Yahiko corpse, or the Nagato corpse. But he just called him that because he saw the eye, I guess. Because the actual long-haired version that doesn't look anything like that kid. Oh, but there are six, yeah, okay. So they, they started as seven. It was, so it was, it was seven, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. I gotta admit, the music they play for Pain is uh, it's pretty cool in its kind of melodramatic way. Mm -hmm. I forget how that works, though. There, there are seven people, but it's the six paths of pain. I think maybe they replaced one. The one he lost, they replaced it. There's a fucking balloon floating outside of my window. What is and that? And there it goes, don't worry. All right. A helium balloon just floated up. Some was kid... it penis shaped? No, it was, a, it was a one. Oh. Some kid just let go of their balloon, and that's going to go strangle a seagull. <laughs> and uh, right. we'll continue our lives. Naruto-chan-yo. <laughs> Oh, he's been there for a few days, okay. He's been there for a few boys, I said. <laughs> I'm guessing it's like the, the environment like sucks chakra out of you or something like that. Not even, but in the game explanation, that's, that's what happened, but... <laughs> You begin to acquire natural energy. Uh -huh. Energy. Oh my God! Now give us give us some explanation as to why chakra's bullshit. Tell me why chakra, the device of this entire fucking story, is just garbage. It's shit tier, and we should have never used it. It was a mistake. Come on, let's go, video game. All right, you know that ninjutsu uses mental energy and physical energy from your own body, right? Sure. <laughs> like, throw chakra under the bus. Let's go. <laughs> In contrast, energy you acquire from the outside is called natural energy. When you've mastered it, you'll be able to use sage jutsu. More powerful than ninjutsu. The secret fourth category that was never mentioned. So it's basically... Genki Dama, but without consent. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically what's happening. Mm, mm. Little bit. It's um statutory you know, Genki Dama. It, it, no, it's it sells. <laughs> it sells version of Genki Dama. It's like, planet, give me your stupid energy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, but I don't wanna. I'm Did gonna, I ask you? I, I took it. <laughs> I took that energy. <laughs> oh my god. 
Uh, when you begin to use Sage just for the first time, you'll reach the status of Sage. So yeah, it turns Sweet. out all that shit that Jiraiya was talking about himself was not just, like, titles, but it actually had a purpose. Because he just called himself the, the Sage, yeah. and that Sweet. word meant nothing, right? Harrison then? Jiraiya Sanjo! That part is true. It re-energizes your body. Okay. Okay. Alright, chakra comes from within, natural energy comes from without. <laughs> I think the power of Ado also takes the energy from outside. Yeah, it's it's that it's that Confucianism coming in the the the, the Bushido concepts of of the outside like your you, you, your family's more important than you your country's more important than your family protecting things is the most important thing you can do and being part of the whole is like. Everything outside of you is more important than you are as an individual, and uh, there's normal there's normal sized frogs too. Yeah, there are. Right, never mind. We saw them. I'm an idiot. Um, and I might just be full of shit, but uh, I feel as if like the whole like you know nature leaning into your power, nature lending you power, and and oh. like the outside yeah. kind of like giving you energy. Is a bit of is a little bit of that idea. I think it touches a bit on the whole like um, the 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 communal strength is the true strength, right? You know, versus instead of versus, versus your individual, selfish yeah. power, versus right? some individual term. individual yeah. power, greed, and so on. And it's funny because um, uh, 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 my my girl just beat Persona Five the other day. Oh. And uh, the whole story is about it's, it's, the theme of the story is rebellion, right? It's like rebelling against the corrupt establishment. Yeah. But it's only okay to rebel as long as the corrupt establishment is being defeated so that people can then rejoin your side. <laughs> because rebelling and being selfish on your own is not good enough. You have to be selfish in order to reveal the true community that's going to back you up at the end. If you were standing alone and then the game ended or the world ended with you being alone and being selfish or, or doing the right thing without the backing of the rest, yeah. it would be like a false power. It would be like, oh, that's terrible. No. <laughs> Why are you doing that? <laughs> Where's the support? Right. The harmony of... of, of, of uh, uh, the harmony of, of the, un the, un the unit, right, needs to be maintained. So they got a Jiraiya clone in front of him? Yeah, yeah he's pretty much. To train with. One might even say that uh, it's like the nail that sticks out gets hammered down, so don't stick out. <laughs> unless you choose to, you plan to stick out for good reasons. But then in the end, you're sticking out so that everyone else can be pulled out as well, and then you're all at the same <laughs> level again. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. tragic. So I'm pulling myself out, I'm standing higher, but it's so that I can pull you all up together yes. with me. And now <laughs> oh. we're, all, we're all together at the same place, <laughs> where you shouldn't stand out now, again. <laughs> you cannot stand out. Don't stand out. Basically, don't do anything. Don't, <laughs> Just don't, don't try. I mean, I mean, to be fair... Oh shit. To be fair, um, it's just it's just a, an entirely different reference point, right? Like it's you can easily laugh at like our selfish individuality and the fact that like everything about our culture is is wrapped around like, you know, I like independence, right? Independence Day, like the the the, the great American story of like, you know, kind of leaving behind the old country and like becoming your own nation without having to deal with their bullshit is a big part of who we are. Um, not to mention the, the fact that uh, Christianity is backing that, so self-sacrifice is a huge thing that we're obsessed with, right? 
And I mean, lots of lots of cultures are, are have self sacrifice as a big thing, but and for us, it's like the, it's like almost the end all be all in a lot of cases because Jesus, you know. Anyway, I don't have much to say about yeah, this. But I don't. Just, I don't. Just, I really don't know much about that. That's fine. I'm just. I'm going places with some of these. Uh, <laughs> These cultural comparisons. It's the way that, it's the way different cultures tell stories, you know? There's like a no I just noticed a huge difference. After consuming a lot of Japanese video games and playing a lot of anime. <laughs> watching video games and playing anime. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, then, okay. uh, <laughs> I, I feel like I eventually started to see some of these patterns. No, I'm surprised you are able, able to have this Korean conversation while fighting and you're like, are you even thinking about fighting? Just like... You have three options in this game, <laughs> right? Dash, jump, throw kunai, or mash circle. Right. And occasionally charge your attack or so. so. that training wasn't hard at all. Not much, no. I assume it's much more convoluted and puzzle oriented and you tell me when the time to find out what this is supposed to look like is. I'm not gonna tell you. I'm gonna show you. That's what I mean. Like, tell like, me when we should cut to it. All right. I know. I know exactly when. Um. So here's the other thing. Like everyone's got their different animals that they hook up with and stuff. Do the uh, like? Does the does the snake kingdom or the snur the 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 snail not snail the, the slug, slug kingdom the slug? have the same level of like, you know? I I, I don't know how vast it is. I, uh, all I know is that um, each person or clan has like a more affinity as of to certain uh, animal. Yeah. So um, you know, Kikashi is with dogs, right? Yeah. Um, and the Uchiha clan is cats. Yeah. Um, um. So I guess I'm like, can only the frogs teach you about sage? stuff. Oh, the sage jutsu. Um, is it only the frogs that know that shit? You know? Or, mm. or is it actually something that other animals can do, but just it doesn't get brought up? Okay, well, I guess to answer that question is kind of spoily a bit. Okay, well... But it, the, the answer is yes, and I don't, I'm not going to say more. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah. Just the frogs. Okay, yeah. that's fine. No, I mean, mo um, yes, as in um, there are the anim or the animals can. Other them. animals can. Okay, yeah, yeah. good. That's fine. That makes more sense than just the frogs. Mm. But also, like, yeah, it would suck if you got stuck paired up with an animal brand that you just don't like. <laughs> that would be awful. That'd be the fucking worst. I mean, imagine if, like, you're born into Shino's family and you fucking hate bugs. Bugs. <laughs> Which is funny because I'm going to tell you something. One of the filler episodes, so it doesn't matter because oh it's filler, boy. right? Yeah. Um, Naruto is in a world, in a reverse world, and everybody has an opposite uh, personality. Stop. Stop. Just stop right there. <laughs> just, literally, just stop. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <sighs> Cut the crap. <laughs> Shino ends up afraid of his bugs. Yeah, pretty uh, much. Well, not afraid, but hates them. Stop. <laughs> Just stop. <laughs> oh, you're Kikashi now. now. Well, this now is the time to watch. Oh. Because okay. um, the training for Naruto is over in the game. That's it. That's that was the end it. of his training. That, yeah. Okay, but because I watch ahead. The the, uh, the the game now so yeah. that now I'm more prepared. But it's like but like like video game wise, we're it, not, the training is over. We're never gonna go back and <laughs> no, find out what's no, up. No. He's just gonna show up glowing and kick someone's ass. Gotcha. Okay. But in the next watch, um, we're gonna have to watch a lot. God, what the fuck is context? Cyber Connect. I understand time, budget, planning, etc. They figured it out later. It's fine. Yeah. All right. You tell me where to go. Okay. Alright, so what actually happened in the Sage Village or Mount Mioboku? Part one. What what are we what are we wanting here? He's eating that awful cooking that the old lady was gonna do? Is that yeah, the I, I mentioned it before, right? The, the cooking is bad. Mm -hmm. That's Gamabanta for sure. No, that's Gamakichi. Damn. He, he grew up. He looks so He grew big. up. Yeah. Looks so Whoa. similar. Alright, my bad. 
So Gamma Gambanta will always have a pipe. That's how you yeah, really recognize. Yeah, the big back on sign on his back. You're right. Okay. So when you're hungry, what? What's the object lesson? Okay, the explanation you had it, you received it before yes, in the game. Yes, that, that's the exact same. But uh, he'll continue elaborate on that. Okay, outside. Oh shit! That's a frog dick. <laughs> Mental and physical energy are molded to create chakra. Seijutsu involves taking that internally generated chakra and adding nature from the outside. It's the same thing word by word. Resulting in an even more powerful chakra. That leads to all your ninjutsu genjutsu and even your taijutsu getting a real power boost. Oh! Oh, that's new. That's different, yeah. Mental and physical energy within oneself and nature energy from the outside. Okay, but it boosts the things you do. Right, okay. It's not like it's a whole other category of magic. No. It's just a different battery for the same end results. If you add mint flavor to chocolate vanilla ice cream, <laughs> no, it tastes that's, even better. That's a bad analogy there. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. But we can go right to the next. Okay, so that's it? That's that's all? Like, the... yeah, this was the explanation of what the energy energy is about. Okay. Got it. Alright, what do we jump to over here? What explanation? This waterfall is the secret toad oil. And what's so special about toad oil? Didn't he spit that out at, at pain for a second? No, that, that's not the same oil. oil. <laughs> oh, okay. Or at Conan? Or... or something, yeah. Someone mentioned some oil for a second while we were watching that. Oh, but you'll see. This has the property of attracting nature energy. Helps with training. Okay. Whenever you rub this oil on your body, <laughs> nature energy can enter through here. It's time to oil up. <laughs> Seriously? Get that Hakan tech. Oh my god, I don't like his face. Is he high? <laughs> god. That's kind of creepy. Some cannabis oil. <laughs> CBD. CBD, let's go. <laughs> However, there's, there's a, risk. a risk. You might get too high. Oh, he's looking like Jiraiya now. When one used by one who's inexperienced in controlling nature energy, you start to turn into a frog. Ah. Okay. That just seems like an allergic reaction, man. <laughs> so Jiraiya was actually like holding back, I guess, and spending a lot of his energy trying to not turn into a frog. Well, basically, Jiraiya has has that um, mastered the the, uh, the seijutsu one hundred percent. That's why. He, that's why his appearance changed. Ah, uh, okay, okay. <laughs> My brain immediately starts racing to be like, okay, but what about other animals that are not frogs? Do you turn into a frog then, you know? <laughs> you, Whatever. You asked the I asked him many, I, I know, but it's it's because of my brain. I like it's just, that's immediately what my question is. Like as soon as something get introduced, I'm like, I'm, I, I know it'll, I'll learn in time. Okay, here we go. Oh, so he needs to practice to get that balance in his life. Yeah, otherwise it takes over completely. Exactly. Oh, you yeah. remain a frog forever. Ah. What I mean about you having to die is you should stop being human. Ah. Uh, hmm. Okay. Well, you can read my mind now, can't you? What's my next question? <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't My next know. question is, are are these animals actually animals? Or are they people oh. that turned into well, animals? Well, yeah, the... you just asked the question at the right time. He just said, he just said, right? All these stone statues are previous students who failed the training. Right. You were asked like, really at the same time. If you start transforming into a frog, I'll beat you thoroughly to reverse it. <laughs> so the frog stick. Wait, so they turn into a frog and then they turn to stone? 
I, no, I think the stone is a homage for uh, the peop the victims, I guess. Uh, Jiraiya always acquired some frog features, but he was among the skilled ones. I thought you'd hesitate after coming this far. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, I guess I was just kind of like... Are we secretly learning that these talking animals that wear clothes are actually just people that, <laughs> you know, are full of sage energy and that's why that's that? Okay, next. Got it. Okay, so just putting this oil on immediately. Wow, that's pretty fast. So if you just fuck it and if you just can't hack it, you immediately turn it to a frog like in seconds. Yeah, yeah. Okay. A better trading method. Do you know what it is? Yeah. But what, but like, are they all gonna fucking... Yeah, but he's gonna yeah. explain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The experience of the Shadow Clones reverts back to the original. Yep. But the reverse is also true. Ah, if one completely changes into a frog, it's over. Ah. That's why you can do a million. Of yeah, them. yeah. Right, right, right. The downside. It's like you'll get your results faster, but it's also just like don't fuck it up. Yeah. So he just has to like literally like. Like meditate. To oh, uh, to uh, try to sense the uh, the uh, the the sage uh, energy. Uh, I mean the nat uh, mm -hmm. the natural energy. He has to stand still. He has to not move at all. Okay. Or sit still in this case. And the process of sensing it allows you to, I guess, decrease it to the point that it stops turning you into a frog. Because right now the only reason why he cannot use the uh, the natural energy is because he cannot sense it. So that the first thing he has to do is be able to sense it. Yeah. And this is important, by the way. Yeah. You can tell by the camera zoom. <laughs> only possible for you and Jiraiya. Otherwise, I wouldn't even brought you here. Do you kudo? Unless you already possess an enormous amount of chakra, nature energy would just take you over right away. And Naruto is cheating compared to Jiraiya. <laughs> so exactly. That tells you how much of a boss Jiraiya really was. Plus, they must have the guts to never give up. Oh. That's the kind of person who can become a sage. <laughs> yeah. Okay, go to the next part. You're Nindo. It works for the plot! Appears you've mastered toil old, Toad Oil Assisted Control. Yeah, we now fast you, forward. Now you have to control it without the oil. Oh, cool. You feel the power. Then just your tracker consumes your internal energy. The more you use it, the more exhausted you become. In contrast, Sage Jutsu Chakra draws an external energy so it will not tire you. In fact, you'll recover and heal it quicker. Yeah, that was explained in the game too. So that thing about... that doesn't even look like Naruto there. It's a... <laughs> mix in the Nine Chails Chakra and he shows a full remarkable recovery. Um, so that whole thing about like him getting tired extra fast in the beginning was... Uh, related. In the game, you mean? In the game, yeah. Like I said, it was wrong. Okay. It was completely wrong. So is there something about this area that's supposed to make you more tired? No. Okay. Not at all. It just made it up. It is, the game just made it up. Got it. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's almost as if getting this destiny. back when you were still alive would have been an important <laughs> thing. Almost, right? <laughs> like, while you're still alive. What a concept. <gasps> you, you remember this, but now, now because Naruto is the whoever one reading reads it, it. Whoever reads it puts themselves in their shoes, yeah. 
I get that. Dude, it's such a fucking dick move, man. To just be like, I'm not gonna tell you shit. Oh shit, I died before I could tell you anything. See, the weird part is that we know, like, what he looks like when he's an adult, and here it's just an adult with a, a Naruto head, kid head on his body. <laughs> it's not at all the. the you know what yeah. it is? Like, reboot. When Enzo. Uh, in, adult in, in, Enzo, adult from, Enzo from season two. Yeah. 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 Which is like a skinny version. Totally. But he's, he's a teenager, though. Yeah. If there's such a thing as peace, I'll seize it. I'll never give up. Yeah. It's like, this is like a preview of, of adult Naruto without being him. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Hey, hey, isn't that cool? Isn't it cool to learn this? After he's fucking dead? You assholes. It's such a such douches. Oh my god. This is the part you would like to know too. This part. Mm -hmm. Can never understand his feelings. You were friends with Orochimaru long ago, right? Yeah, he's always going on about killing the kids and murdering the orphans. He's a good guy. <laughs> Orochimaru changed after his parents were killed. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Context. He became obsessed with the forbidden. He longed to see his parents. Oh! Maybe he was trying to resurrect them. Whom he held responsible for his deaths. My parents weren't killed. So like you, I was, ac I was accused of not being able to understand. Perhaps he was right. I didn't understand the thing about him. But, uh, even I can see there's too much hate in our ninja world. I want to do something about this hatred. Man, Drag growing up with his wholesome family, full fucking parental growth, no, no tragic backstory, no bullshit. What is this garbage? You're not a Naruto character. <laughs> No one abandoned you? <laughs> it's trash. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I already suffered. Right? <laughs> oh, you know what it means, actually? It's like him, between him and Azuma, it's, and, and uh, even the third. If you have a family and everything is fine, that's because you're the one that's gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> you're the one that's gonna fucking bite it, and Someone everyone has to. Yep, and you'll leave the rest behind. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Because, because. He gave me something much more valuable okay. after he died. But you know what? It's fine. Because... Okay, okay, stop there, stop there, stop there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you gotta stop that. Yeah. Okay. Because, uh, I'm not, whatever, I'm not looking at it, but I'm just okay. saying, like, that it makes me think of how, um, you know, uh, 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 oh god, why did that happen? It makes me think, God damn it, stop it, Netflix, thank you. Um, no, okay, well, hey, you know, we'll just, it's fine. Um, it makes me think of uh, uh, um, that gif with the Animal Crossing thing where, like, the mother passed away but left her behind her Animal Crossing town. Why? Right, and, right. and then the son found it and was like, oh, she left all these messages. The daughter, I think. Yeah, or daughter, something along yeah, those lines. When she played the game and the, the, the message was there for her. Uh, and yeah. so on. So it's one of those things. But, you know, it's a heartwarming tale if you didn't grow up, uh, like, all fucked up from being alone and crying sitting on a swing 
for at least four <laughs> intros and three endings, I want to say. How many OPs was that? I don't know. And every flashback. And everyone fucking hates your guts. <laughs> and oh, if you just had a little bit of context, you might have been not better, but at least not super fucked up, abandoned over it. I don't know. What am I? I, I don't know. I'm, I'm no child psychologist. I can't fucking call it. <laughs> you didn't experience that. You didn't uh, have your parents uh, killed. He grew up just fine. What are you talking about? <laughs> Look at him. Does that mean I'm going to die? <laughs> okay. So, here we go. Next episode. These are all the failed... I, don't, I assume they're not literally the, the bodies of the dead students. No, no, no. There's just, I think it's a stone in homage to the... Uh, yeah, the... yeah, like a grave. Okay. Focus. So, even though it's just a little, your body's moving. What a weird drawback to this secret. Power. Some weird shit. Hmm. But then again, it's like, it's, yeah, you know, whether it's Kaioken, right, or any other kind of like unrelated energy to what we've seen oh, so far. Why okay, can't I yeah. take this oil with me when I fight? Then I won't need to learn how to use, how to take in nature energy without the oil. Nope. Doesn't work. Outside of the mountain, the voile vaporizes immediately. Oh, what is this Ocarina of Time shit? Ocarina of Time? Yeah. We have to, like, rush from the mountain to, to get the bigger on sword thing. And you have to, or not, no, the, um, the hot water in the bottle. Or was that, uh... Maybe I'm thinking of um, Twilight, Twilight Princess with the hot water. Yeah, that's possible, because I didn't play Twilight Princess. Okay. Well, anyway, if you don't hurry up and you leave the place, the water goes away. It was a terrible reference, all right? You called out my terrible reference, Billy. Are you happy? <laughs> what are we watching? <laughs> okay. Next training site. What about it? Uh -huh. Stack a stone slab atop that summit and begin Zen meditation. If your concentration wavers and you move even slightly, you'll fall to the bottom of the ravine. You know, this is what actual ninja training looks like in, in like other things, right? Like yeah. they're always standing up on a, on, a, on a stick with one foot doing that cool pose. Although at this point... It's not it's exactly a stick, but it's still hard. Mm-hmm. Also fucking oh, dangerous. Balancing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, you, if you remember, maybe you've seen from uh, Jiraiya's flashback, he was, he was doing, doing that the too. same thing. Right, right, right. Emotionlessly synchronized with nature. It's kind of like when uh, Nero does that in the intro to DMC4. Oh, wow. On the church pews. Ah, uh, you fucked. Okay, this actually. I think that's, this part is not actually important, so we can skip ahead to the next part. Okay, balance training. Gotcha. Yeah, I think we can skip. Yeah? yeah. yeah. Alright. Fucking Looney Tunes, like, Pratt Falls and shit. <laughs> like... Dramatic music and uh, scenery. But that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's that's your your that's your montage training. Yeah, he's looking good. He's amassing nature energy. And then the stink waves. <laughs> <laughs> ah, look at him! He's got the stink lines and everything. <laughs> so it's it, 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 it's called senju in Japanese. Yeah. Senju. Okay. No, no, no. Senju, or senju is a sage. Camp. No, Senju is the clan uh, from uh, Hajima, uh, Hajikasha. Uh, first of Kage is the clan, oh. Senju. Okay, wait, what's, um, what, what's the word for Sage? Uh, seven? No, wait, I forgot. I'll think about it. 
But anyways, welcome to the sage mode. Ah. That's the sage mode. Displaying rings around the eyes, proof of sage, sage mode. hood. Sage, no frog <laughs> sage hood. Sage hood. Sage <laughs> hood. Now he just joined the club. Okay. My ninja. Yeah. Even though. Right, that's where that mascara comes from. I saw that stuff and I was like, why is he got, why is he got the mascara on? What's up with that? And okay. Just to prove that he's in sage mode. Uh, Yo, he didn't catch him. No. <laughs> what a dick. Oh, it doesn't uh. hurt. Okay. That's, That's how it. it feels like when you're on PCP, Naruto. <laughs> That's what <laughs> drugs does. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, uh, uh, uh Hold on, let me just... What are they calling Sage Mode in Japanese? Because you said it last time we were recording. Yeah, but You said I, the word, but... I said the word, but I forgot. Because I thought that the Senjutsu stuff was all the nature energy jutsus. Senjutsu is the nature energy, yes. That's what I was... That's Senjutsu, okay. Yeah. Okay, that, that's the word I was trying to remember, okay. Got it! All right. Now we're talking about the risk. Once you fully grasp the risks involved, then you can use Sage Mode to its fullest extent. What are the risks? Do you need these creepy frogs on your shoulders? You can't maintain it for too long. Obviously, it's Kaioken. To amass the nature. Kaio what? <laughs> to amass the nature energy in the Tantra Sage Mode, you must be following the principle of staying still. Thus, it cannot be used once you begin battle. When you are still, you're an easy target for your enemy. Right? So the only time you can go into sage mode is when you've got plenty of comrades around you that can free you up. Um, That's why you summon the uh, Jiraiya for distractions. The yes. yes. But if you're alone, but must go into sage mode, withdraw from the battle momentarily and gather nature energy. Because you literally have to stop moving. But it's useless! Grope, grope. Disappointed. I'm here to alleviate that risk. You have to rely on your nakama, Naruto. Use your tomodachis. If you and I merge our bodies. Get Aibo. Okay. Lightly attached to your shoulder or back. This is like. It's so weird. <laughs> like, like I, 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 I just the, the style. Like I, I, like for example, seeing the um, the, the goatee, the goatee, and like the kind of incarnation of the fraud, the toad stuff is cool. Uh, yeah, like Jiraiya did. But they like having them sticking out of your shoulders is like I'm like that's not cool. That's weird. <laughs> you know, <laughs> it's a weird design prompt. It reminds me of like. Like some, some, I, I can't, like, what am I, I Can mean, you get stop here? Okay. I'm like, am I thinking of cartoons or maybe like, there's definitely like a transformer or some cartoon or some form where they powered up and like, it just involved having like fucking things sticking out of your shoulders and it looked really stupid and everyone was acting like it was cool and it was awful and I, and I this doesn't work because I don't remember exactly what it was, but, um, this reminds me of that. Uh, so you mean like the, the series, the, the storytelling is telling that's cool, and your your eyes are telling no, it's not. Having frog <laughs> creatures that like are old people with goofy fucking, it's it's just. I mean, it, it, it could be a comedy comedy drill. It like this. yeah, it functionally like you know I understand their explanation. It's just aesthetically like you know weird looking. But I suppose when we get the big glowing orange thing that I keep seeing on the logo and the cover of every fucking box, then. That's the cool version on its own. So I get it. I get it. We'll get there. Okay, so congratulations. I'm we caught just up to caught where up we are. For the training. <laughs> because the game literally tells you training by beating the, the clones. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And so far, all we've seen of him is he's got a hard body now and shit doesn't hurt. But we don't actually see what he does with it. Uh, that's right. Got it. 